Assalamu alaikum, I am Kajal Muktadir and welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to show you a sample plot design for forest inventory using ArcGIS. Okay, so here I have the shape file of Khadim Nagar National Park. To download this data, open any browser you have and search for protected planet. Click the first link here or check my description box for this link. And in this site here you can find the protected area shape file and uh, also CSV file. Okay, for example, let's search for Kajin Nago. You can see Kajin Nagar protected area. And you can see here this is the boundary line of Khadim Nagar protected area in Bangladesh. And these are some data connected to it. And to download this file, just uh, click here download site GIS file. And you can cite .csv file and .ssv. And this is the shape file. Uh, download this, click here. And uh, you can see, uh, you can download it from here, just click here. Okay. After you have downloaded this file, you may have to unzip this file. Okay, so this shape file here, you can check the properties, and go to source, and you can see this current geography uh, current coordinate system is uh, GCS, or this geographic coordinate system, and uh, we have to change it to projected coordinate system ECS okay to do that uh, first of all uh, go to geoprocessing and we have to set our environments so click geoprocessing and environments under it and under workspace select you can select your workspace as for example I have created a uh, folder for sample plot design and sorry, sample plot design and inside the folder I have created a uh, geo database and I rename it as uh, a, a 100 and you can uh, I, and you have to select uh, click add to set it as your workspace and uh, go to raster analysis and select mask as uh, this shape file okay and click okay and after that we have to change our projection system and we have to change it in pcs as projected coordinate system to change the to change the projection go to data management tool and under projections and transformations uh, double click here project and uh, input data set as your this file and you can see here uh, the input coordinate system is gcs wgs 1994 and you can't change that and you have to choose your output coordinate system as i'm choosing uh, WGS 1994 ETM drone 45 North. Okay, and after that, click OK. Here in this file, we have changed our co uh, coordination. Just uh, go to here properties, and you can see the current projection system is projected coordinate system WGS 1994 ETM drone 45 North. And click OK. Okay, after that, create a new blank map. And click blank, blank map and OK. Add the shape file that we have currently changed our projection. As this is our map here. OK. 
and you can see uh, go to properties and you can see the current projection system is projected coordinate system okay okay so after that go to search box uh, you can go to search box by here or you can uh, click here search or control f okay so i am typing here create fishnet Okay, you can here see create fishnet this is the toolbox and in here you have to uh, set output feature class and next template extent as this same as layer and let's select our cell size weight as 300 and weight as 300 also and this uh, depend on your uh, study and click ok so after uh, the fishnet has completed just uh, uncheck it and we have to clip our map so that the points outside the, our map is uh, eliminated uh, from here to do that go to geoprocessing and go to clip and input features as your create plot level and clip features as your protected area and click ok okay so we have done it and this is our protected area and this is the point files uh, points inside it and you can also change the name as sample plot sample plot ok right click here and open attribute table and let's add feed as x and select type as long integer and click ok and play uh, create another feed add another field as y and also long integer okay and have a field at sample plot and uh, leave it here for the integer and click here and go to calculate geometry and uh, select here property as x coordinate of point and click ok and in here um, go to calculate geometry and uh, select property as y coordinate of point and click ok here is our point and we can uh, you can see we have our x y coordinates here uh, and uh, we have uh, our id field or uh, recognize the field so we don't need this field uh, so delete this field okay and and next go to sample plots and go to properties and go to levels and select level field as oi and click ok change this uh, as follow and uh, level features so that's how we can create sample design for uh, forest inventory and if you want to work in this data with uh, excel you just open attribute table and uh, switch selection and right click in here and copy selected and open an excel sheet and uh, paste here okay so that's it uh, thank you for watching my video subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get the uh, first and also like, comment and share this video with your friends. Goodbye. Assalamualaikum.